up guys welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel I'm Natalie if you've never seen my face before and I'm so excited you're here today today's video I am super excited to do because I have recently been getting into the Christmas spirit I know it's only the beginning of November but it comes up quickly one of the reasons I wanted to make this is because I personally have a really hard time coming up with ideas of things I want because I have everything I want already but my parents always ask me for options and everything so I wanted to give you guys a bunch of options if you you are interested in creating a Christmas list this year or these can be things that you can give your friends and family as well I just compiled a bunch of different things that I think would be good gifts to receive or give and I want to share them with you guys so I have a list of over 50 things so I kind of just want to get right into it but let me know in the comments down below what you guys are wanting for Christmas this year or what you want to give your friends and family I'm really excited to start doing Christmas videos even though I still have my Halloween stuff up I need to change that out soon but make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and let's just get right on into it. Okay, the first thing I have on my list are AirPods. I have these personally. They're just great for listening to music if you're in the store, running, or whatever you want to do with them. They're amazing, so I put that on there. Next is LED lights. I have LED lights. I love them. I turn them on every single night. You can change the colors to change how your mood's feeling, so those are always really great. The next one is a Barefoot Dreams blanket. I personally really, really want one of these. I know they're super expensive, but I heard amazing things about them. Next, I have Air Force Ones, but not just the white Air Force ones those are obviously great too but the shadow air force ones i have a bunch of pairs of those and those are personally my favorite ones i'll pop some up on the screen of different ones that i really like or have and that i think would be a great gift next i have personalized jewelry with like names or the year you were born i have this one right here from adina's it just has the year i was born and i love these you can find them on amazon etsy adina's there's a ton of different jewelers that do personalized stuff and i think they're so cute and just special next i have silk or satin and pajama sets I really really want one of these I've never like been a pajama girl but I think these look so comfortable but yeah I think these would be really great next I have a gym membership if you are looking to get into fitness or anything like that that could be something to ask for because I know those are quite expensive next I have products from Glossier my favorites are the boy brow lip gloss and then paint cheek tint those are all ones I use on a daily basis. I'm obsessed with them. They have really great products overall and they're not too expensive, so that'd be a good thing to put on your list. Next, I have a pair of slippers. I personally love the Emu slippers. My sister gets me a pair of those for Christmas every year. They're my favorite. You can find them on Free People. I think Urban Outfitters too. But obviously, if you're looking for another option, I've seen great options on Amazon or Target or anything like that, so you can check those out. And next, I have matching sets for activewear. Some of my favorites are from Set active gymshark has great ones lululemon's obviously a great brand it's still expensive but if you're into that that could be something to put on your list next i just have a new pair of tennis shoes my personal favorites that i would recommend are the nmds i have the white ones they're super comfortable and just easy to throw on and then also my girlfriend recently got me the adidas cloud foam ones and I have the all white ones in those as well, but they seriously feel like you're walking on a cloud. It's the best thing ever, so I totally recommend those, and they're not too expensive either. And the next option I have is a subscription service, so that can be Netflix, Hulu, Disney+, Plus, YouTube TV, anything like that. That'd be a great option. Next, I have the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Liner. I am obsessed with this lip liner. It's hands down the best one I've ever used. I use it practically every day and I definitely recommend this one. Next I have Zara jeans. Zara has the best jeans, the best quality, and the best prices. I personally think if you have not been put on those already, I'm about to put you on because they are so good. Next I have a nice perfume. I've never been one to like purchase a nice perfume for myself so this could be a good thing to put on your list but recently I did purchase the Gucci Bloom perfume and I'm obsessed with that. I've also heard the Ariana Grande Cloud one is a good option. Anything from Replica, they have great perfumes. Next I have self tanners. I personally use the loving tan one and then the tan Lux face drops but there's obviously so many self tanners and they're amazing if you want a little bit of a glow in the winter time the next one i have on my list is a vankio mini projector i have it up right here i get so many questions about it i have it in my room as my tv and i hook it up with the amazon fire stick it's like around a hundred dollars best thing ever next i have candles obviously bath and body works has great candles anthropology has great candles there's also higher end candles you could ask for or even target amazon has a ton of candles 
little options. I have the skylight. I have one over back here, but it's really nice during the nighttime just to relax and calm down. I know a lot of people have that, but that could be a good thing to put on your list. Next, I have oversized t-shirts specifically from Urban Outfitters. That's where I get all my oversized t-shirts and free people. Those are like the two best ones, I would say. From Aritzia, I would say their boyfriend zip-up hoodies and then their super puff shorty jacket. Zip-up hoodies are so comfortable. They're obviously more on the pricey end, so if you wanted to get something cheaper, that's obviously great too, but the quality of these will last you so long, so I definitely recommend those. And then the super puff is one of their winter coats. I have that. I got it last year for Christmas and I'm obsessed with it. Next, I have the boys lie hoodie and sweat sets. These are more on the pricey end. I personally have one and it's like the best sweat set. I wear it constantly. It's so comfortable, so I really, really love those. Next, I have any self-help books or wellness journals. I personally picked up some wellness journals lately because I've been struggling with my mental health and that's obviously important to work on, so I think these books help a lot and you can just take time to write down throughout the day how you're feeling and different things like that. Next, I have the platform Converse. I know these are sold out a lot. I recently got my hands on a pair and I wear them all the time. They're like one of the best purchases I've ever made. They're obviously super trendy and cute, but that would be a good thing to put on your list. Next option I have are phone cases. My personal favorites are from Wildflower and Princess Polly. This one right here is from Wildflower. They have so many different options depending on your vibe and they're really, really cute. Next, I have a hardcover suitcase set. I have the Calpac one, but I think just a travel set is really good if you are one that likes to travel. Obviously, right now we can't, but it's really great for just like taking it to a friend's house too if you need to. So I really love my Calpac set. Next option I have are Doc Martens. I personally love the Jaden ones and then the Chelsea boots. I think those are like the cutest ones and they go with everything. So those are really great. Next option I have are makeup palettes. My favorites are the James Charles one and then the Jaclyn Hill Volume 2. That's like my all-time favorite palette. And the more Feet palettes aren't that expensive compared to a lot of other ones. Next, I have food container storage. This is kind of more for like my age people or if you live in your own apartment. I really like the aesthetic of putting food into containers and having them stay nice and organized. Next, I have a picture collage kit. I personally have the Tezza one. I know a lot of people love that one, but there are so many options on Etsy. If you go to Etsy and type in collage kits, there are so many different vibes you can pick from, so that could be a good thing to put on your list if you want to spice up your room. Next, I have car decor. I recently I got a new car. I found some really cute air fresheners to put on. I have little clouds that go on my air fresheners, so they're a lot cuter than just the regular ones. Also, the cup holder coasters, I have those. There's a ton of different options on Etsy for different colors and everything like that, so I think those are really cute for cars. Next, I have the Buxom Plumping Lip Gloss. These are my absolute favorite lip glosses, but they have so many different options, and my favorite one is Kristen, so if you put this on your list, definitely get Kristen because it's the best. Next, I have a Polaroid printer. I have the Mint Polaroid Pocket Printer, and I love it. I can just print off a ton of my own photos instead of using like a Polaroid camera I can use it from my phone and it connects up to it so that's a really great option the next thing I have is any hair tool waver curler blow dryer straightener anything like that next I have a coffee machine I personally only like iced coffee so I recently got the mr. coffee iced coffee maker it's specifically for iced coffee it was like $30 at Target best thing I've ever purchased if you're into like hot coffee or a little bit of a nicer vibe you can get Keurigs and there's a ton of other coffee makers if you like iced coffee Mr. Coffee Maker has an iced coffee machine. It's the best. Next, I have a silk pillowcase. I really want one of these. I heard they're great for your skin. And as I'm getting older, I really want to protect the skin. So I think I might put this on my Christmas list this year. Next, I have cooking sets. Again, this is if you're living in an apartment or a house. But cooking sets and like pots and pans are really expensive. So this could be a good gift item. Next, I have a car wash pass. I personally have a car wash pass and I use it like every single day. This could be a really good option to put if you have a car that you want to keep clean. Next, I have a glass jewelry box. I really like the glass ones that are outlined with gold. I think they're super, super pretty and dainty, but there's a ton of different ones if you're not into that vibe. Next, I have Final Cut Pro or a camera if you're into YouTube or if you want to get into YouTube. I use Final Cut Pro for editing, so that could be a good option for a gift because it is expensive. Next, I have a massage gift certificate. I have personally been thinking about this recently because I feel like I'm so messed up in my back and I just really need a massage, so I think that's where that came to mind, but any like gift certificate to get your nails done or hair done or anything like that could be really good. Next, I have a tile. If you don't have a tile, you absolutely need a tile. If you double click the tile, it will help you find your phone and vice versa. If you go to the tile app, 
it will help you find your keys if you have a tile attached it's the best thing that's ever happened to me next i have an acrylic calendar i just think it looks a lot nicer than like a regular flip calendar so that's a great option next i have neon signs these are obviously super in right now and i love my neon sign i want like a really big one one day but they're super expensive so i know urban outfitters etsy shops have a ton of little neon signs you can get if you want to take a hobby or anything this is a good time to ask for that gift like a skateboard snowboard penny board longboard anything like that if you want to take up a hobby that would be a good gift option <laughs> next i have drinking glasses again if you're over the age of 21 wine glasses moscow mule cups martini glasses anything like that to add to your collection would be a great gift idea to put on your list next one would be jordan ones obviously those have become huge this year i personally like the mid ones i have the digital pinks and the light bulb ones and those are my absolute favorite ones they're super cute but there's so many different options i really really want the lows in pine green that is like my dream shoe right now i thought those would be good options next i have a hydro flask hydro flasks are really really nice water bottles but they're super expensive so it'd be a really good thing to put on your list if you don't want to spend the money for it next i have a gift card for gas if you drive a car you obviously know how expensive gas can get that would be a good option if you want to save a little bit of money and ask for a gift card for your gas next option i have are roller skates i found some really really cute ones i'll pop up here on urban outfitters but there's tons of different ones i think they're so cute and it'd be so fun to do in the summertime when it comes around next i have ankle weights i personally love bala bangles i don't know they're right here but they're really cute and they're great for working out at home if that's something you like to do next option i have are card games for like you and your friends or significant other there's so many online next i have disposable cameras really really cute ones at urban outfitters i found so i think that would be a really cute gift idea next i have an ipad air and apple pencil this is obviously a huge gift i personally bought this for myself recently and it's coming in the mail soon so so watch out for an unboxing because I'm gonna get into that and I'm so excited for it to come so look out for that and last but not least I have on my list is a shower speaker <laughs> this is kind of a weird one to end on but I absolutely love my shower speaker it's like changed the game for me I can listen to podcasts music anything like that in the shower and it's really really nice all right guys that was all the gift ideas I hope you guys enjoyed this it took me a while to come up with these but I thought these were really good gift ideas so I hope you guys did too and I hope you got some inspiration to add to your list if you have any ideas leave them down below because then others can look at them and add them to their list and vice versa so i think it'd be fun to chat in the comments well, i love you so much and i will see you guys in my next one